Do you see your faith as a burden or an opportunity? Coming up next on Pastor Bob Daily. A burden or an opportunity? And you know, most people define their faith in one way or another. And although most people wouldn't say their faith is a burden, they carry it around as if it were. A burden, a heavy load. Jesus says, take my yoke upon you. My, my burden is light. My yoke is easy, he says. Well, we don't always carry it that way. You know, when I look at faith and I look at religion and I say, okay, here are all the things that I have to do and I struggle to do it. And I look at other people who are enjoying their sin and I say, I'm a Christian, I can't do those things. And we're jealous because they can and we can't. Some people feel that way. And sometimes we look at our faith and we just feel condemnation We feel all kinds of religiousness, but we don't feel any kind of, well, opportunity and positive emotion. You know, your faith is not a burden. Your faith was given to you. Your relationship with God was given to you on the cross. And because of that, God invites you to have a personal relationship with him. Now, that's altogether different. And you can drag all of the religion part of it into it and and see everything as a burden that you have to bear. A lot of Christians do that. A lot of unhappy Christians out there. Or you can see it as an opportunity. You know, I've said before that a lot of people live their life on the edge, the wrong edge. They see how close they can get to the world without falling off. Folks, that's a miserable existence. The Bible says pursue holiness. That's a totally different edge. And when I do that, sin is no longer such a huge equation. I begin to enjoy my relationship with God. I begin to um, to see opportunities instead of problems. And I begin to see my faith as something positive and not something I have to drag around and something I'm yoked with and I can't get rid of. So if your faith is a burden today, folks, really think about this, would you? Really begin to think about what that means to you and, you know, why it is a burden. Wouldn't you rather have a light burden? Wouldn't you rather put your cares upon him and have him care for you? Wouldn't you rather that your faith was not based on a burden, a heavy burden, but that it was based on an opportunity to get to know the God of the universe and to fall in love? You see, that's what he intended. And that is light. That's exciting. And that's where we're supposed to be. So I hope you're not carrying around a lot of burden today. If you are, never too late to make the switch. God bless you. Have a great day.